Hello everyone, FunshineX here. This is episode 8 of my SimCity Let's Play. Before I get started building the cities, I would like to tell you about how you as a subscriber of mine can play with me and how we can make more of a community build. What I would like to do is take part in the SimCity World Challenges, which SimCity has launched. It's kind of their reason for multiplayer in the first place, other than DRM. Uh, if you go into the challenges here, we see we've got a new one starting in six days, so that would be March 23rd. We need 2.5 million population in the region as fast as possible. We want to do it in the top 10% to get this achievement. So if you guys, like, guys would like to take part uh, in this uh, with me, go to your friends list in SimCity and add me. I am Ron Douglas, just like that. And I don't have any friends. <laughs> Uh, so add me as a friend. I'll accept anyone's friend invite. That's fine. Uh, I'd also like you, though, to email me a screenshot of you showing uh, your highest population city. It should be at least 100,000. Um, if you can't get to 100,000 in a, in a region or in, in one city, then you're probably not going to be able to do this. Because if you see 2.5 million, 16 cities, we're each going to need at least 150,000 population to achieve that. Um, there are ways to get 300,000 plus, so uh, that, that would be the minimum cutoff, 100,000 in a city. It's really easy to do. Um, should have the screenshot, should have user, username, what like. Uh, anyway, so that's not going to start for six more days. But if you want to join me on that, uh, tell me, tell your friends, and we can all play together. Okay, so let's go into our city. And we'll start off in Creeperville. If you remember, uh, the objective today will be to connect all of our cities with some more regional transportation. Really all we have right now are buses. Uh, we would like to get increase our train capacity, increase our ferry capacity, and add a um, airport as well to our industrial city. Those are our goals for today. Whether we can get them all done will remain to be seen. Um, so Creeperville has a train station with only 867 people riding. I think they just ride it out of the in the void, you know, because there's nothing, nothing, nowhere for them to land. Our ferry, 18 people, so they're really not, not going anywhere. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all. Do we have a, a regional bus terminal here? I can't even remember if we created one of those. All the cities start running. Uh, together. So let's do this. Where are you? Regional bus terminal. Do you guys see one? That's our shuttle bus depot. No, we don't have a regional terminal, really? I'm going to pause recording just real quick to make sure. Okay, I haven't been able to find one, so let's go ahead and plop one in here. Um, where would be a good one? Good place to do this. Maybe get some rid of some of my commercial here, because they're still complaining about workers. Let's go ahead and get of you. And oh, great, I can't fit you. Maybe in here. It takes like the whole block. <laughs> do I have room to expand if we build it here? Yes, I do. Okay. Is this good? Uh, yeah, sure. Okay. Bus terminal needs more buses, of course. Oh, I guess I didn't really need that space in here. Oh, well. Let's start with four or four garages, so that's twelve buses. Twenty-five thousand riders per day. Our bus system is going crazy. They hang out in these little caravans. They like to just follow each other around, which supposedly is gonna be fixed in a upcoming patch. Oh, got some upgrades going on there. I think that's all we really need to do with Creeperville. Um, I probably want to put in one more like uh, tourist attraction, but I don't have the money. Let's run in fast and get that real quick. Someone in the comments wanted to see the uh, the landmarks. They're not really called landmarks in this game. They're called uh, just the culture buildings. 
And I actually haven't put in a uh, Department of Tourism in my region, so I can't even build these. But we have the Expo Center. Um, some of these you can like, it's kind of like Max's Man, where you can click on it and do things. So he's going to fight crime. This one you could click on it and then like host an event, and it would have different events you could choose. But that can hold 3,000 people. This one's got up to 15,000 people. And then you've got these other ones that all they do is just attack, attract tourists. Uh, there's one special one, though. This one here, not only being a tourist attraction, it actually can add 1,100 residents to your region. So that's actually a really cool one. It's, I, don't, I don't know how many people live in these high-rises. It doesn't even say. Yeah, I don't know how many people live in a high-density residential. Um, but yeah, we need that Department of Tourism, don't we? Empire State Building. <laughs> You know, this is another one where you can hold events. I think that's the only really special ones. All the other ones are just, uh, tur oh, here's another one with events. So now you can see, they all cost between 50000 to 200 and some. Have 10 high-density, high-wealth residential buildings. Really awesome achievement. I was thinking about that, starting to try and go for, like, <laughs> really cool achievements. Okay, let me look at my... Let's go down here. Can I build a department? I 75,000 people. I can put a sign out front? My goodness. Okay, so... This city, I think, is done until we can get a Department of Tourism. And then I'll plop that other guy in there. I've got plenty of money coming in, that's for sure. Medical problems, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Let's go over to the industrial city, because that's the one they need to do the most work on. Come on, city. There we go. Okay. So this one, we've got the buses coming in. 117 people only. That's fine. Could probably add a few more bus garages there. But let's also... This one has a train, so let's put a train station in. be able to keep my nice straight roads with this. Go with you, curvy road. Yeah, good enough. So that one really doesn't have anything to do but a sign. Although they will complain, they'll be like, add more trains, add more trains. There's no way to add more trains, other than making more of these, I guess. I don't know. Okay, and then we want a ferry to take our people back and forth. We're not going to have a little enough money for that for a while. What do you want to tell me? Oh, you want to build an archaeology, huh? No, thanks. Does he know we're building this space station? How much is a ferry? 31,000. That could be a while. <laughs> Let's take a loan out. Oh, my goodness, we still have two loans already. Okay, and then this just goes along the water. Connect the road is here, uh, road here as well. Straight road, please. Oh, we got a medical emergency here. No, I don't want to do that.
No, I did not say do that. Alright, we'll see if people take the ferry and the train now. Uh, oops. <laughs> not what I meant to do. Zero people so far. <laughs> He's still hiring. Here come the buses from the other cities. Come picking people up. Do I not even have? Okay. Let's make one of those. I'm not getting a lot of money here. What's it want to tell us? The ferry terminal is closed. Yeah, I know that. Commuters 284. It's funny because I have so many people in my other cities and so many way buses, but only get 283 two people in and there's a thousand extra jobs I think commuting is just maybe not the way to go <laughs> the people just don't realize that there's that many jobs the other day I was playing this guy and I had the traffic all the way back it backed up into this city it was pretty cool you got enough workers yet It's actually going to be difficult without any money coming in. Might have to gift myself money from the other city. Alright, I think we're going to have to make just make more residential, and that'll be the end of it. There you go. So many buses. <laughs> Alright, anybody riding the train yet? Oh, come on, ride the train. <laughs> That's the whole reason I made you. You've got no people. I'm getting people for you. Those are loud plop sounds. Okay, moving in. Work at the ferry dock. Nope, not yet. So I think this one's saying only 153 per day. I think that's 150 of this city's residents per day. Because there's like thousands from the other cities that are using our buses. But there's no reason to commute out from here. I hate how they do this. <laughs> Let's go see the dump. The sewer. How many people do you need to work? I'm sorry guys, this is kind of boring. I might have to cut some of this. That's not going to happen. There we go. Now it's working. Let's hopefully get some people. Come on. Just right to here to here. Across the bay. Alright, 
More residential, I guess. There's your commercial. Uh, it's just gonna make more demand for jobs, won't it? Oh well. Come on, you wanted houses, build them. They want medium wealth houses, so we need to put some parks in. You guys want a sports park? Play some baseball? Just take out half my area that I just zoned. Yeah, not enough simoleons. Okay, never mind. These things are cheap and they add a lot. I like this guy here, 400 bucks. He's tiny, so you can fit him in these little spaces. There we go. Now if we look at land value, it should be up right there. Nice. And then it gives all this medium wealth housing, which they're upgrading right now. Cool. It's pretty easy. Maybe we need another park over here. We've got ten thousand, so we can put that put in the sports park like we wanted. And where did it go? Ah, no! <laughs> I spent it all on a road. go start upgrading your houses people you want to build dr. Boo's tower don't you A gel cell. I can't give you one. I'm sorry. I give you a flag and a sign. That's about it. All right. Well, let's head over to the other city because this one's not. Well, let's see. Is our ferry doing anything? No. Train. Three people rode the train. I guess it's more in the morning. All right. I'm going to pause it real quick. I'll come back in the morning and see if we have any commuters. All right, our first terminal ferry just arrived. Our ferry arrived at the terminal. 103 people came in. Okay. They were all just residents, so they're coming in to work. That's good. And the train. 84 people. So is this reflected in our visiting? Yes, that went way up. <laughs> We got a lot less unfilled jobs, but that's also probably because we added all this residential. Eh, oh well. What's wrong with the fire? Fire burning out of control. Where? It's just one house. Do you see how much money I have? I don't have enough money to give you more fire trucks. Oh, it was an abandoned building. It's now on fire. Wonderful. Twenty grand, huh? And I can't take out any more loans, so. Streets aren't safe. 
Let's see how bad they are. Yeah. Nice. There's like tons of stuff going over there. Someone's getting uh, robbed. Someone got apprehended. No, two people got apprehended. Oh, there's a murder right across the street from the police station. <laughs> they brought. So that's the thing is, if you have a jail here and it's over full, they'll bring the criminals here to the jail, drop them off, and then they'll just walk out and start terrorizing your city. There. Now you have a jail. Go catch some criminals. Apprehended. Sweet. We'll need a fire station eventually. Twenty thousand more dollars. Too much crime. They're all moving out. <laughs> eh, new people move in. Okay. Back over here to the region view. Load you up. And keep in mind this is my first region play, and because of I haven't really played sandbox mode, so I'm kind of like testing things as I'm going. In this hall, residential and all industrial cities not quite working as great as I wanted them to, but we're just gonna stick with it. All right, we are losing money, huh? Transportation is taking a ton of our money. These people have the bus terminal, 1,100 people, and then all these people doing the park and ride. We need to get them up to the train. So, mass transit train station costs 40 grand. Okay. Let's put it right there. Cannot create smooth terrain for road here, huh? Okay. Had it. There we go. All right, go commute. There's a train station for you. Park. You. You. Happy? <laughs> like one guy's happy. He's like, oh, I got a fountain all to myself. And let's put another one. These guys aren't happy with their barbecue pits. We'll get one of those. What an arcology. <laughs> Do I look like I have a million dollars? Oh, people are commuting up here. Nice. We put a bus stop here. Will that help? A thousand an hour. Holy crap! It's all in transportation and now bond fees, huh? Okay, you guys can pay some more taxes. And we need more residential, aren't we? For now, <laughs> that works. And these will be my farmers. Oops. Come on.
Look, you guys give out no commute time whatsoever. You just get on the train. Alright, they're upgrading. This probably means my population's going down. I might as well let them live here for now, and then when we build the university, we'll bulldoze them. Kind of mean, but I need people in my city. What are you frowning about? Worried about your income, huh? Go commute. There's a bus right here. Need more buses, huh? Interesting. <laughs> that was an easy quest. I don't think that's quite what Maxis had in mind. Train station closed. How could it be closed? I Got a billion workers looking for jobs. <laughs> There's 84 people here waiting. Where's the train? There it goes. Yay! Yeah, this train's coming. What's your problem, people? All right, see how our commuters out are doing now. 260, only 100, or only 250 unemployed. I don't know. The problem is I'm adding more people. <laughs> it's like it's not helping my plans. What is this building going up? Oh, there's a bunch of little avenue buildings going up. Cool. Okay, guys, what do we want to do next? I need money. Hey, we're in the positive. I think what I'll do in between episodes is I'm just going to play Creeperville, just let it run, and just take care of any problems as they come up, and just get myself, you know, like $200,000 and just mail gifts to these other cities as they start to grow. They're just not doing as well as I'd hoped. But we've got a lot of people commuting now. Holy crap. <laughs> well, let's upgrade this road. This will eventually be an avenue. What are you? There we go. coming home, I guess, from their jobs. Wow, lots of people rode the train. Okay, so 346 people rode the train, but only 140 commuted. Does that mean they couldn't find a job? This doesn't make any sense. Let's turn here, turn here, go there, there we go. So much for farm people. <laughs> Why are you going, people? I don't get it. <laughs> Look at this traffic jam. Whoa! Okay, guys. Well, we accomplished uh, kind of what we wanted to do. We did get our transportation options up. We didn't get the airport yet. That's just too much money for now. But we did get train stations in all of our cities. We did get a ferry terminal. 
and it looks like they're both being utilized pretty heavily. <laughs> um, I think if I made this all high, then this would be a straight through right now. It's a stop and go. There we go. That helped. Well, helped a little bit. <laughs> Anyway, next time I'm going to go ahead and gift myself some money so we have something to play around with and not we're just sitting here waiting for money. Until next time, guys, it's been Funshine X for uh, SimCity. Let's play. Bye. Don't forget to sign up for the uh, the challenge build. If you have any questions, uh, go just comment or leave something. I'll put information in the description.